What's up guys? All right, so I've got a new video today. My truck, as it usually is, it's filthy again. And I've been parking in a different spot and it seems like no matter what I do, birds like keep nailing my truck. So it's like nasty. There's lots of pollen out. It's just a horrible time for vehicles. So I've been thinking I want to wash it, but not only do I want to wash it, um, just there's been so much like junk like all over the you know place. Like it's probably like stuff, some of it's probably starting to stick to the paint. Can't talk today. Ugh some of the stuff is starting to stick to the paint um, so making my paint a little bit rough so i want to clay bar it now i had an old clay bar kit that i'd had forever um, it, i think it finally kind of dried out so i picked up something today at o'reilly's that is this mother's clay bar kit and it's actually like a ceramic kit too okay so what you get in the box is this little synthetic clay pad all right this is what i was really after right here this little synthetic clay pad um, I got a buddy with a with an older Corvette, and he said he used one of these, and it worked really good for him. And they seem to last longer. It's like there's a I can't remember exactly how many times you can use it so many times on a vehicle um, before it goes bad. I didn't really want the ceramic kit necessarily, but that's all they had, and it was only like a few bucks more than like the original kit was anyway. So you got that. You get this um, ceramic detailer. I don't think this is. I mean, this isn't the same as a real ceramic coat that you go pay like a bunch of money for. But it's at least, it's, it's some sort of ceramic formula, right? So uh, that, and then you also get this nice little uh, microfiber, okay? So anyway, I'm gonna wash my truck. I'm just gonna post a few clips. Um, not got my brother here, so I don't have his nice DeWalt pressure washer, but uh, you know, I'm just gonna wash it in my driveway and uh, just kind of show you the, the clay bar process. Let's just see how it does. I right, guess I'm just using some uh, Chemical Guys car wash, a little microfiber mitt. Got this big brush for some hard to reach places. And a bucket full of soapy water. Let's go. Okay, guys, so I've washed this thing once, right? I think I'm gonna go over it one more time because it still just got some really heavy junk in it. And then I'm gonna spray the wheels down with this. This is really cheap wheel cleaner. But um, you see there, picked it up on the clearance rack and then it was like some percentage off of that. So I got it for like $2 or something. So I'm gonna spray this on the wheels, see how it goes. And I have yet another bucket of soapy water. So this is the third one I've made. Okay. I think what I'm going to do is use the soapy water as a lubricant for the clay bar. Let's see how it goes. Alright guys, so all I'm going to do is just take and dip my little clay bar in here. I'm just going to start doing an area at a time. I guess I could have used the little silicone spray stuff, but I don't know. I just wanted to try the soap. I've seen people do it that way before. And I think you're not supposed to go in a circular motion like I've just been doing. You're supposed to go side to side. Do a small section at a time. I'm probably doing this like totally wrong. These synthetic ones you're probably not supposed to, uh, probably not even supposed to use like soap. You're probably, probably supposed to use some kind of compound. Seems like it's working though. So I'm just going to do that. And if there's anything I couldn't get off, hopefully the soap and everything it'll, it'll kind of all work its way out so I've got some little weird spots like in the paint and I'm hoping this will pull them out like if you see there's like a little black smudge right there I think the clay bar is pulling it out yeah so here's the only downfall there's some little areas like in here a little tough to get this in there Whereas like a piece of clay, you know, you can slide your whole hand in there. That's okay though. I still think it's working pretty good. All right guys, so I went ahead and finished the truck cleaning it that is. I went over it with uh, some 
some chemical guys waterless car wash just to get the water spots and things like that out. Looking pretty clean. So now it's time for the ceramic detailer. Now, it's got directions on the back. It says you should spray it on there. Spread it out with one microfiber and then buff it with another. They only give you one. Luckily, I've got a second. So, I'm just gonna show you kind of the process here. I'm gonna start with this little rear view mirror, or uh, side mirror. So just spray a little on there. Get this out of the way here. And again, I'm trying to hold this at an angle because I don't want you to see the back of the truck just yet. So wipe it on. And take and buff that out. Feels smooth. Will it do anything? I don't know, it's part of the kit. So let's get the rest of the truck done and see what we think about it. Okay guys, so I finished up the truck. I'm gonna do like a few little clips at the end. Uh, just kind of walking around showing you. It looks really shiny. On video camera, I don't know if you can tell. You know what I mean? But like it's uh, it's super smooth feeling now, which clay bar always does that. But um, the ceramic stuff, you know, I mean, for what it is, I think it's all right. I went over the whole truck and I still got quite a bit left here. So uh, the kit, I never did say how much it cost. It was like $33 plus tax, $33.99, 37 taxes and all or something like that. Um, I think it was okay. I mean, I, I might could have got cheaper online. I just, I wanted the clay bar. I meant to order it online, didn't. Went to O'Reilly's. They usually just sell it by itself and they didn't. All they had was the kit. So that's all I could get. And I was like, well, I want it. I'm just gonna go ahead and get it. But that was usually like 20, 25 bucks. So for another $8, I don't know, it's not too bad, you know, and then taxes and all that. So, but overall, I think it was pretty good. Um, they could have given you two microfibers because I mean like microfibers are dirt cheap, right? Like, you know, they could have given you like two or three of those. That would have made it more premium feeling, but it was a nice microfiber, I guess. Um, so anyway, overall, yeah, I liked the kit. I thought it was cool. The ceramic stuff, I don't know. Everybody's doing that now. It's not it's not the same as like a real, you know, like heavy-duty ceramic coating. But I mean, it's it's got some sort of silicone type formula. I, I don't know. Whatever. It's cool. Um, anyway, if you watch this video, I sure do appreciate it. Hope you uh, will like and subscribe. Leave me a comment. If, uh, if you think I did something kind of stupid the way I clay barred it, you know, you can let me know. Just don't say nothing, you know, vulgar or, or too ugly. I don't like that. But uh, let me know. And next video, I want to show you what I was trying to avoid in the in the back there. So I put something huge on the back of my truck, and I'm really excited to show it to you and, uh, you know, talk about it. So I just want to make sure the truck was clean before I do that. So next time, you'll get to see something awesome. And I got a new car for my wife, so that's pretty exciting. So anyway, again, like, subscribe if you're watching. I sure appreciate it. Later.